Salespeople, this one is for you. In this video, I'm gonna break down the top three AI agents that you need to build inside your business to close more deals, blow out your competition, and just exceed any quota you ever have. All this is built directly in Cassidy. Let's dive right in. The first AI agent that I'm building is a post-sales meeting agent. So this is a workflow that runs every time I finish a sales call and does all the tedious work that I need to do after I finish a sales call. This is things like taking note of the competitors that were mentioned, sending that post-sales email to the prospect, filling out any feature requests that were mentioned on the sales call, or even just filling out the next steps in my CRM after a sales call. This usually takes me like an hour after a sales call, basically all entirely automated by this AI agent. I'm gonna show you an example of the draft follow-up and capture all the details of a sales call workflow here. So after every meeting, it classifies the meeting into a discovery, a demo, and a proposal. Basically, what is the stage of the sales cycle that we're in? If it's a discovery, it performs a different set of actions than a demo or a proposal. For instance, if it is a discovery, it actually drafts up a follow-up email to that prospect automatically for us with the relevant case studies directly custom to that potential client we just spoke with. Another example of what I built specifically for my AI agent here, and you can customize it for what you want, is that I wanna make note of any feature requests that were mentioned in that call. So if I'm building a product, someone goes, hey, I would love for it to have X feature, the transcript picks up on that, takes that, it actually adds that to a JIRA ticket directly in our JIRA board for our product team to know. So it's a great addition to the workflow. I also do something very similar with competitors. If a competitor is mentioned on the call, I want you to directly message me on Slack. So even if anybody on my team has a sales call, I wanna know who are the competitors that are being brought up in that conversation and this AI agent make sure that that actually happens. The key thing about this workflow, which automates post-sales emails, is that we can actually review and approve those items. So it's sent directly to me, directly to the account executive to say, hey, I'm about to send this email. Do you want me to send it? This is so important for AI agents is that they actually need to be human in the loop. They can't just fully automate end to end. You wanna make sure that you actually like the content that the AI agent is coming up with. And that's the way that you can do this. Finally, it takes the next steps, the meeting notes, the summary, everything, and it adds it directly into our HubSpot. That way, everything is centralized in our CRM. Obviously, good sales practice here, but this AI agent takes the work off the salesperson and just onto the AI agent. So I would say this meeting agent, it's one of the best AI agents you could set up to start. Let's jump into AI agent number two. The second AI agent is the AI meeting prep agent. So basically every day I am swamped. I've got calls back to back to back. I usually have like no time to prepare. So this AI agent is set up to basically do all the preparation for me. Give me all the details that I need to know in order to crush my sales calls, right? One of the best ways to increase your win rate in sales is just to come up, show up more prepared to these calls. And so this AI agent does all the pre-call research that I need to do based off of my calendar for the day and allows me to just continue to focus on showing up these calls and closing deals. This is a previous run. I'm gonna show you how this workflow works. So this was a meeting, took it from a day, looked at all the things that was happening that day, kind of looped through every single meeting to see what was going on, took all that information, and then sent me an email that morning, right away, 8 a.m. What is going on? What do I got that day? So I could see exactly like who I'm talking to, what does the company do? What's the information we know about in HubSpot? What's the previous meeting notes? Who is this person's boss so I know exactly who to reach out to if I want to multi-thread the deal? And all this is just sent in an easy email that I can just quickly read every morning. One of the best ways to close more deals is just be more prepared. Make sure that you're coming up and showing up prepared and ready to crush the sales calls that you have for the day. This AI agent does that for you. And let's dive into the third AI agent. This is the speed to lead AI agent. As you know, when you get a new prospect that is interested in your product, time is of the essence. You need to go quick. What this AI agent does is make sure that they're getting a touch point from us as soon as they sign up for the product. That isn't some BS generic email that everybody gets, but it's hyper personalized to who that person was that signed up and then also gives you all the information you need to do to make that deal close much faster. So let me dive into this. In this example, I'm a legal CRM software. So I basically have laid out for the agent, what is the different criteria of the people that I wanna to talk to? So you can see here, I have this rubric set up where decision-making authority gives them 40 points. The organization type and size gives someone 35 points potentially. So you can see this leading score rubric. I basically have a bunch of different scoring in place that I can for sure know if someone's gonna be a great lead and then assign a A, B, C, whatever the score is appropriate to that lead. Then from there, it's gonna actually draft a personalized email to that lead. This is not a generic welcome to our product email. This email is specifically set up to the size of the company. 
So if it's an SMB versus a mid-market versus an enterprise lead, the way that we talk about our product is gonna not only be custom to the size of the company, but it's also gonna be custom to the person's LinkedIn. We know what that person actually likes, what's the product they're most interested in, what would be most impactful in the messaging we send to that person. The other key thing here is that human in the loop. No matter what, we always wanna make sure that we do a quick thumbs up approval that we actually wanna send off this email. So I'm gonna get the approval from the AE before we send anything off, but it's drafting up that email. If I think it looks good, I'll give it a thumbs up. It's gonna send it off. The last step in the process is that I wanna go find the most important people at every single company that comes in the door. So a lot of people are gonna to apply to your product, they're gonna to come to your service, but they might not be a decision maker. So this final research agent is gonna go look at that company that applied and go find exactly who is the person that holds the budget for your product. Who is the person you really need to get in front of to close this deal faster? And then it's gonna add all that to Salesforce. The key to closing deals is that ultimately the person who's the decision maker is the one who's gonna have the final sign off. And so if you know who that person is from before the first meeting you even have with a prospect, you're better positioned to actually close this deal, I would say 10 times as fast. Anyways, those are three of my favorite sales AI agent. There's a ton more, all built inside Cassidy. There's a massive template library where you could basically just pick and choose. But I think the key to AI agents is that don't do what I just did. Customize them to what your business does, right? Every AI agent that can be more personalized to how you run your sales process, What's the type of leads that you get in the door? Are you selling a service or are you selling a product? What is the tedious process that happens after a meeting that you currently do? Try to replicate your day-to-day -day work with the AI agents you built. Use those three as a source of inspiration. The key to seeing value with AI is to just start building. Just try to start building these agents so that you can even save, hey, even 50% of time 60% of time. And then over time, it's only gonna get more and more efficient. Dive in, start building, and comment down below what AI agent you wanna see me build next, and subscribe to this channel if you wanna always stay in the loop with the latest and greatest AI agents that are being built. We'll see you soon.